my Craftsman T210 riding mower. It's officially three years old. Video coming soon. As a matter of fact, my very next mow, I'm filming the three year anniversary video. There's also another three year anniversary. The same day I bought that mower, I purchased these from Amazon. 3M WorkTunes headphones. Let's take a look. Here they are, the 3M WorkTunes. Press a button to turn them on. Speakers inside, they have an integrated microphone. Noise reduction rating of 24 decibels. They work well. Now when I bought these, and I've been using these for three years solid, when I bought them, I was kind of hesitant because at that point, the reviews were something like three stars or 3.1 stars. People were saying they quit working, they didn't have good enough range to even have the phone in your pocket. That is not my experience. As a matter of fact, I looked today and the ratings on these are 4.6 out of five stars. So clearly, people have figured out that these are pretty awesome. Let me just give you a look at this box. And the reason I'm making this review or this video, I intended on reviewing these right after I received them, but you just can't review headphones all that well because I can't let you hear the audio through these speakers. So let me just talk about if these are worth the money. I paid $49.99 for these. I looked, they're 52 something today. I'll put a link down in the description. Here they are, work tunes, 24 decibels, noise reduction rating, or 24 decibel noise reduction rating. They are a media player. They also act as a phone and have hi-fi sound. More information. I'll let you pause that and read the back, the charge port on the bottom. They have the yellow stripe. There's also a version of these that are yellow on the outside, but I went with the black, which is this yellow stripe. If I had a Cub Cadet, that would look really, really good. On my Craftsman, I kind of wish they had a red stripe version like they have on their box here, a red stripe. But let me tell you how these have worked and held up and the charge and all that. How long does the charge last? Well, so long that I don't even keep up with it. Let me see, well, I can't, can't let you hear. Let me see if I can hear. Turn these on. Okay, Bluetooth connected battery medium is what it just said. And that's what they kind of stay at. They'll either be battery full or battery medium. I don't think I've ever got to battery low and I haven't charged these since January. I was mulching leaves the last time I decided to charge them up. And even then they were at battery medium and I don't think I'd charged them for probably four months. Well, here it is June and they're still working, I cut all spring. With this one charge, I'm, well, at least I'm pretty sure, I don't think I've charged them again. Either way, they last a long, long time. And let me tell you the range on these, and they're completely adjustable. When they're on your head, it's easy to adjust, to squeeze and adjust. I wear a hat and then put these over the hat, plenty of room. So here's the deal. Battery life, so long, I don't even keep up with it. Bluetooth range, my lot is, I believe, 75 feet by 150 feet. I can have my mower parked at the back edge of my lot and make it three quarters of the way up my lot before they start cutting out. And the way I know that is I park my mower in the shade when I'm done and then I go around and I weed eat, and only when I get to the front of my house does it start cutting out. That's when I go, oh yeah, I left my phone back there on the mower. So yeah, plenty of range, definitely enough to be on your mower, be working immediately around your mower. I've never had any cutouts at that point. They work well with Bluetooth notifications, like if I'm cutting the yard or cutting a different yard, I can still get my ring notifications when there's motion detected. And surprisingly, they work quite well as a speakerphone or a headphones phone. I don't even know where the mic is. Let me see if I can, there's the mic. There's the mic hole. There's the charge port. There is the cable if you need to connect to a media device. And you know, that's pretty much it. One button, one button simple, and then two ports. And of course, that microphone. Let me tell you, I answered a call 
while I was cutting with these, and to my surprise, I mean mid-cut, I didn't even slow the mower down. Full speed, blades going full speed, plowing through grass. And the person said that, I believe it was my father, said that not only could they hear me, they could hear me quite well, and were shocked to know that I was actually cutting grass. They knew I was on the mower. And they said that they could barely hear it in the background, but they could hear me fine. I could hear them fine. So these work quite well. I think they are a great buy. They're a great buy for me. Now they're rated for pros. I don't know, you know, use these every day. They're comfortable. These, you know, they get sweaty, but they are comfortable. I wipe these ear pads down regularly, but they're quite comfortable for me, but I only mow, you know, maybe up to two hours at a time. Usually it takes me about an hour, 10, hour and 15 minutes, maybe an hour 30 to mow. But I also clean my mower. So yeah, probably talking about a two hour ordeal per cut. And like I said, it'll go months and months, or I'll go months and months without having to charge these. They just keep going battery wise and they're three years old and I don't see any signs. If this were a cell phone, I would know, you know, you'd have that battery already dropping below 80% or whatever. I haven't noticed any degradation. I was a little concerned that these wires would somehow cause a problem from getting moved because they are exposed, but I haven't caught them on anything. I mean, I do try to take care of these. You can see a couple little nicks here and there. Actually, I think that is specs from off insect repellent or mosquito repellent, but there's some nicks where I've dropped them, things like that. Have them on the seat of the mower and forget and lift the mower seat up. And they go tumbling. So they've been tough for me. They work well. They're decently comfortable. Now I do wear a hat. If I didn't have a hat on, I don't know how comfortable this part would be. It's just rubber. But with a hat, quite comfortable. Battery life, can use them as a phone while cutting. So if you're working, especially if you have a yard business or something like that, landscaping, and actually talk on the phone while doing the job that's pretty impressive for a set of headphones and listen to music and the audio quality, you know, I wouldn't rate these on up there with the highest fidelity, big, awesome audiophile headphones, but they're also definitely not bad headphones. They sound quite decent on a scale of one to 10, where 10 would be the highest fidelity headphones I've ever heard. And one being the cheapest little headphones that you could buy that I've ever heard, the little tinny ones. I would rate this at about a seven. It's about that good, maybe maybe a 6.8, somewhere like that. It's hard to tell because you have the drone of a mower going in the background. So with the drone of the mower, the audio quality is quite good. I'll, I'll say it that way and leave it there. So there you go. That's these 3M WorkTunes Bluetooth headphones, pretty good. I've enjoyed them for three years. I thought I would share this with you. And now I can throw this box away and I'm not gonna toss it like I just did and make a very, very loud sound. I'm gonna set it right there. And in this video, thank you so much for watching. Drop a comment down in the comment section if you have any experience with these and or what you use for hearing protection. Have a great day.